Ubuntu 24.04 LTS Noble Numbat was recently released, and in this video, we're going to review it. Firstly, Ubuntu 24.04 LTS comes with an improved installer. It's Ubuntu's same Subiquity installer, with beautiful, more consistent, redesigned pages that have an icon on the left and the options on the right. The installer now features a new accessibility page letting impaired people tweak Ubuntu for their needs. Also, there's now an automated install option that lets you use one YAML configuration file for multiple computers, which can be useful for setting up an enterprise fleet of Ubuntu computers. Minimal is now selected as the default installation option, which includes a browser and some utilities, although you can select Extended for a more normal installation with an office suite, email client, etc. Experimental support for ZFS and encrypted ZFS was reintroduced into Subiquity, and experimental support for TPM-backed full disk encryption has been added. If used, instead of you entering the disk password, the TPM will securely manage the decryption key, although you can still use traditional full disk encryption if you'd like. There is also a beautiful new App Center written in Flutter, which looks much cleaner and more modern, and a new firmware updater app. Games are no longer pre-installed, so less bloat, Cheese is replaced with Snapshot for the webcam, and Thunderbird is now shipped as a snap package. Ubuntu 24.04 LTS also comes with GNOME 46. To summarize it, Nautilus got some features and improvements, the settings app was redesigned, several apps were improved, notifications have a new design, and much more. Check out my GNOME 46 review for the full list of features and improvements. There is also several bug fixes and security patches, performance boosts, and under the hood changes. If a library gets upgraded and a certain service relies on it, that service will be restarted so that it always has the latest security patches, Network Manager now uses NetPlan, and more. Subscribe if you like my content and join the Penguin by Discord community with a link in the description below. Thanks for watching, see you next time.